Hey everybody, um, I just filmed the tutorial for this look. Um, it is Super Bowl Sunday and I am of course wearing my Colts jersey because um, I do live in Indiana and I'm a huge Colts fan. Um, so the game is getting ready to start and um, I'll zoom in here a little bit. This is the look. It is um, a shimmery blue with some blue glitter on it and um, even a little bit of blue mascara. So if you want to see how to do this look, just keep watching and go Colts! So the first thing I'm going to do for this look is apply um, Urban Decay um, Sellout. That is this color right here. Um, another popular one you could use is Sin in place of that. And I'm going to be applying this with just a MAC 239. I'm just going to load that up on my brush and apply, pack that, or pat that on my lid, focusing most of it on the inner half. Alright, once I've got that on there, I'm going to take another 239, or you could just flip that brush over. Um, and I'm going to be applying um, Max Freshwater, which is, let's see if I can find it for you, this one right here. Um, a nice deep blue. And I'm going to apply this wet, so I'm going to spray with just a little bit of Fix Plus here. And we're going to apply that on the outer third. And I'm applying it wet because I want that color nice and vibrant. Blending just a little bit in the crease there. And then I'm going to flip that brush back over and what's left of the cell out, I'm going to kind of blend this line in the middle um, so that there's not the harsh blue and the harsh cell out. Okay, and then from there I'm going to take another um, deep blue from MAC, this is Deep Truth here, and I'm going to apply that with a 222 brush. And I'm going to be focusing that just in the outer V and into the crease a little bit, the outer crease here. And if you feel like you've lost a little bit of that bright blue color, you can go back and add some of that in here. All right. I'm just wiping away a little bit of the fallout there. One way that you can prevent that is just tapping off your brushes um, of any excess before you apply it to your eyes, which clearly I've forgotten to do this time. Um, and then from there, I'm just going to take a clean um, blending brush, this is Max 224, and I'm just going to blend along the edge here so that there's no harsh lines. All 
right, and then I'm going to go in with another uh, fluffy blending brush. This is the MAC 217. And um, if you're more of an NC shade, you could use soft brown here. I am more of an NW shade, so I'm going to use Wedge, um, which isn't quite as yellow. works well for me for blending out colors. And I'm just going to apply that right above where the color is in the crease. And this is just going to transition the color so it's not so, so harsh. Alright, and then I'm going to apply my highlight with a um, Clean 239. Um, I'm going to be applying um, just a skin tone color. I am using some shimmery colors on the lid, so I'm going to stick with a matte color here. This is um, Brulee. For MAC, you could use Vanilla, you could use Mylar, um, pretty much any matte highlight color that you like. And I'm just going to apply that right under my brow here. And then I'm going to go back in with just a little bit more of the wedge. And apply some of that. Alright. I'm going to go back in with just a little bit more of the sellout too and just brighten up this inner corner. Alright. And then now I'm going to apply the liner. Um, on the bottom I'm applying, this is by Sephora. Um, this is one of their retractor retractable waterproof eyeliners. Wow, I really cannot talk today. And it's in the color 04 blue and I'm just going to apply that right underneath the lashes on the lower lash line. And then on the top I'm going to use a little bit of Urban Decay Zero. It's just their black pencil to line the top. Alright, and then to intensify a little bit, I'm going to use my absolute favorite, my Stila Eye Cajal in Onyx, and I'm going to tight line and line my waterline with this. Alright, and just to make the line on top a little bit more intense, I'm going to use this Stila to darken that black a little bit. This pencil is so soft and creamy and so, so dark. Absolutely love it. And then I'm going to add my mascara. I am using the Bad Gal Lash in blue. Why not, right? Everything else is blue. And I'm going to do two coats of this. Alright, now that I have the mascara on, I'm going to wipe away a little bit of that fallout. And I'm just going to add the last finishing touch. This is um, Max Pigment and Reflex T Transparent Teal. And with that uh, 222 brush, I'm just going to dip into here, just get a little bit on the tip of it, and swirl it in the cap, tap off any excess, and then I'm going to spritz with just a little bit of Fix Plus here. And then we're just going to tap that onto the area where the blue is. I'm going to pick up just a little bit more from the cap. And pat that on. I don't know if you can really see this, but it really does give it a pretty blue sparkle. So that is it for the eyes. On the cheeks, I have just a little bit of um, NARS Laguna Bronzer and um, some Orgasm Blush. And then for the lips, I am going to use um, a little bit of Bare Necessity Dazzle Glass. 